hi <laughs> so a couple of weeks ago i've made a video about my bench eating if you have not seen it go and watch it now it's very hard and triggering problem and i know it affects a lot of people and you are not alone if you want to be part of my journey follow me here subscribe to my channel you can also follow me on instagram and tiktok i'll be posting more content there soon <laughs> um i am currently on a journey to get better to help myself with the binge eating i've been on this journey for a long time but i've taken it very seriously now because enough is enough eh? i need to take back control of my life it is extremely difficult it is so so hard but i know at the end it's gonna be worth it i've not binged in a week and a half it might not sound like a lot but considering i was in a very vulnerable state mentally it's actually very great and i'm super proud of myself and of course it's all about baby steps as you say rome was not built in a day so i am very proud of myself yay little dance i'm done i'm done Sorry. And of course, I know this is just a start and I'm gonna bench. 100% I'm gonna bench because this is part of the healing journey. This is the part of the process. It's not ever gonna happen perfectly. Like you're just gonna stop binging and you're not gonna bench for the rest of your life. You are gonna bench. That's the harsh reality. And you have to be prepared for it. And to learn what to do after bench eating episode, please watch this video until the very end because I am sharing some amazing tips here. Um, so yeah, here we go. First one, forgive yourself. Like I've mentioned before, binging is still part of your recovery. You're not gonna not binge. Like that's the goal. But recovery is never like that. It's like that. And hopefully your binging episodes are gonna get less and less frequent, but they're still gonna happen. And you need to forgive yourself and get back on the horse and not to dwell on your mistakes and not to dwell on what happened. So forgive yourself, love yourself, because this journey is all about self-love and compassion because, because binge eating doesn't come out of nowhere. You know that, I know that, we all know that. So it's very important to feel love to yourself, not hatred. I know how it is because every time I binge, I, f I hate myself. I say to myself all those horrible, horrible things. I'm not even gonna say this here, here, but I know this is not helping me. This is not speeding up my recovery. So please be gentle with yourself, be kind to yourself and love yourself. Just think of it as part of the process. Get back on track. I know this very, very well, but a lot of people who struggle with eating disorders have this all or nothing mindset. So for example, after binge eating, they would think, oh my God, I'm such a failure. This is never gonna work. I'm never gonna lose weight. I'm always gonna be benching. So I might as well just eat whatever I want. No, don't do that. This is just one day and tomorrow is a new day a new start just take it day by day like each morning you wake up and think about that this is a fresh start this is a new day i'm gonna do great and don't think about the past and don't think about the future just focus on this one day that's basically how i ballooned up to the way that i'm now i would bench and then i would feel sorry for myself and i'd be like oh this is never gonna work out i'm always gonna be fat and then guess what I've always been fat, so that doesn't work. <laughs> Just get back on track. Nothing is lost. And then on the side of the coin, don't starve yourself. This is extremely important as well. I know after a huge bench, you're gonna feel the urge to just eat less, like eat nothing. That's not going to work because that is only going to lead you to another binge. So don't do it. When you wake up in the morning, eat very good nutritious breakfast with like loaded with a lot of protein because you know what also leads to binging, starving yourself and restriction. So just go back, go back on a healthy diet and don't punish yourself. Just eat normally, eat very healthy, eat a lot of fruits and vegetables and you're going to be back on track. Don't perch. Ooh, guys, this is not what road, this is road to nowhere, to hell. I'm going to beat myself. Don't do it. Don't purge. It's the worst idea you can have, right? Repeat after me. I'm not gonna purge. I'm not gonna purge. Very well. That leads to even bigger problems. Trust me, it's not worth it. It's bad for your mind, it's bad for your health, it's bad for everything. So say again, I'm not gonna purge. After binging, go for a walk. Very like mild exercise. It's gonna be amazing because you know after binging you're gonna feel very very full and uncomfortable and that's gonna help you to get rid of that and also it's very good for your head <laughs> i pretty much recommend walking with uh, like every video that i post here but honestly it's wonderful it's great for your body it's great for your mind just put on some happy playlists there's a lot of them on spotify i really recommend hot girl walk 
um, it's like, you know, very empowering, like I'm a bad bitch, I can do it, you know what I mean. So yeah, the walk is gonna help you to feel much better physically, but also mentally. Fresh air is amazing and light exercise is gonna be very good for you because you're gonna feel like, you know, it's gonna help your digestion, but also in a way you're gonna feel like the whole day is not lost because you also did uh, like a light exercise. Emphasis on the word light. Don't do anything heavy. Don't overwork yourself because that's purging and we don't do it. Another thing to do is just sleep it off. And then you're gonna wake up tomorrow fresh with a new day, new start and you can get back on track. Sleep is amazing. Whenever something's bothering me, I'm like, bye world. <sighs> Oh, your brain is literally helping you solve the problem while you're sleeping and you're gonna feel so much better afterwards. Drink lots of water. Water really helps with digestion and it's gonna make you feel much better. I don't know about you, but like whenever I drink water, I'm like, ah, I'm so healthy now. So yes, I think at least it helps me. So just try it. So yes, that is basically all. Please remember, don't punish yourself. We're only humans and road to the recovery is complicated and very difficult. And be very compassionate about your journey and be kind to yourself. I said it like 10,000 times, but yes, be kind to yourself because self-hatred only leads to binging. Ah. Right? So yes, I hope I helped you a little bit and I'm very, very grateful that you're here with me on this journey and <laughs> you wanna listen to what I have to say and I'm very proud of myself for what I've achieved so far. I hope you're doing well. If you need any help, or if you have any questions, just comment down below. You can also DM me on Instagram. We're all in it together. Don't forget to subscribe. Also, don't overthink it.